You are tuned into your Feel Good Morning Show Expresso here on SABC3. It is a Friday and we welcome you to our youth sports on this Friday morning. With the matrix in their final few days until the end of the year, our young sportsmen and women will be looking forward to some rest. In case of those that excel beyond the norm, it is a chance to test their mettle against the best of the best in interprovincial tournaments, such as the Kaya Majola Cricket Week. In studio today, we are joined by two players that have made it to the Western Province team, taking part in the competition out in Potchefstroom from the 16th till the 20th of December. So from Weinberg Boys High School, we have David Beddingham and Jason Smith. Welcome, guys. Nice to have you on Thank you. Man, you guys had quite the cricketing year, but first up, tell me a bit about the exams. How's it been going? Oh, well, exams are pretty tough, but uh, they're almost done now, yeah. so I'm pretty happy about that. Almost done. Jason, are you, are you happy with how it went? I'm pretty chuffed with myself because nearly finished, as David said, and they weren't too hard, so they were oh, good. That, yeah. That just means you put in a lot of studying, man. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, well. Let's talk a bit about your cricketing year. Weinberg boys, I mean, a lot of school sports websites rated you guys as the best team out there, the best of the best. How do you feel about that, and do you believe that? Um, well, I think in the first term, I don't think we performed to the best uh, of, our, of, of our talent, but um, after that, I think in the fourth term, yeah. we did really well, and we beat almost everyone, so it's a good year. I beat think. almost. No wonder you guys were rated as top. Let's talk a bit about your batting because that has been well documented over the past, uh, over the past year, coming just shy of a century against both Sachs and Rondebosch. What made you come into your own in terms of batting? Oh, well, right. Uh, in the first term, I was a bit like, like childish. I think I matured a lot as a batsman, and mm. I concentrated more before I batted, and yeah. I think that's why. I mean, did you do anything specific to, to improve your batting extra hours on the pitch? Yeah, well, um, I went, uh, I got coached a lot by um, uh, my coach, Ms. Mr. Khaber, and also I listened to Mr. Lefson, who's, who's quite uh, strict and stuff, so it went well, yeah. That's it. And um, um, Jason, you also represent South African, the South African hockey under-21 team. I mean, that's a big passion of yours as well, yeah. but now you have the cricket as well. So, so what does next year look like for you? I mean, are you going to be focusing on both? Which one do you enjoy more? Um, next year is going to be hectic for me because I'm still not sure which one I want to play. So mm. I'm looking to play both, uh -huh. but there's also the Under-21 Junior World Cup next year, so mm. I'm looking forward to trying to make that yeah. team. Because this is not just school level anymore. I mean, this is now the yeah. professional leagues here, and you need to be focusing on one. So I wish you all the best in those and Thank trying you. to figure out what you're going to do. But I mean, there's, it's also known that there's a big rivalry between Weinberg boys and Ronde Bosch. And with uh, the Western Province team largely being made up of the, um, the Weinberg boys, I mean, are you guys scared that the guys are going to be hiding each other's cricket kits or what? Or is it not that bad, the rivalry? Um, I think it's more friendly rivalry because we're all friends with each other. So there will be practical jokes because a lot of them are close with David. <laughs> so they have a go at each other, but it's all fun in games. All right. So what is the one thing you would like to say to them this morning? <laughs> um, I'm on TV, guys. <laughs> so, see you guys I'm on, later. I'm on TV, guys. All right, so obviously the Western team is definitely a team to be reckoned with, you know, in terms of all the games. You guys are ranked number one in the country at the moment, but I'm sure you guys need to keep a keen eye on certain teams out there. Who would you say they are? Um, well, I read our schedule's quite tough because we're playing uh, Northerns and KZN, mm. but I read the teams to look out for are usually KZN and teams like Northerns. Which, which we are playing, so, mm -hmm. yeah. And then looking at the cricket festival happening in Potchefstroom uh, in a couple of weeks, firstly, what do you guys as a team would like to get out of that cricket week, and also on a personal level as individuals? Well, I rate, as, a, as a team, obviously the goal is to be unbeaten, but things do go, go wrong sometimes, so I mean, it's just to adjust mm -hmm. and, and improve our games, obviously. Mm -hmm. And personally, obviously, I'd like to make the SA Schools team, but it's, I think team comes first, and. If the team does well, I think the accolades will come with it. Mm. And what about you, Jason? I mean, on a personal level, what would you see yourself getting out of this week? Um, I think I have the potential to achieve good things out of the week. So I, of course, want to make one of the SA teams. Mm. And then looking forward, I mean, you guys have, are doing phenomenal in the sport of cricket and, well, you in hockey as well. But looking to the future beyond, what, what would you like to achieve? I mean, do you guys obviously, would you like to go pro or, or is this just something you do now? Oh, well, um, obviously every guy's um, dream is to play for the pro tiers or to play professional cricket for, for a living because mm. it's like what we like to do and, and we don't want to mm. just like sit in office because I think that's yeah. quite boring. So I'd, I'd like to be outdoors and doing something pro yeah. proactive. And I'm sure it resonates with you as yeah. well, I hope they've been wanting to do the same. Yeah, love my sport, so 
Can't sit inside ah, much. I love it. <laughs> guys, good luck for the future and also for the cricket week in Pochers Room. The Kai Majola, I know you guys are going to do fantastic, but I'm sure we'll get all the updates from you guys in the future. Yeah, awesome, you. guys. Have thank a fantastic you. day. Good luck for the rest of the exams. It's going to be guys. awesome. So stay tuned to Expresso. Lots more U Sports in the coming weeks. But right now, we are going over to a musical group that's really taking things beyond vocal. Espresso Youth Sport, brought to you by Deep Heat. Warms pain away.